It is that time of the year again. Where did 2021 go? I'm so excited to be sharing my first holiday gift guide of the season today. This is going to be an at home slash home essentials slash cool home stuff gift guide. I first did one of these last year because everybody stayed home last year. And while 2021 has been different, I still feel like I've spent a lot of this year at home and I know a lot of people are still working from home. So I feel like it's also a pretty relevant gift guide for this year as well. So here are some useful, practical, and also just some fun home gift ideas for this season. And I will have a link to all of these things down in the description box. I wanna start off with one of the items I'm most excited about. It is the Breville Citrus Press. I think this is an amazing gift because I feel like we as humans humans universally love fresh squeezed orange juice. If you don't like fresh squeezed orange juice, what do you like to drink? But let's be real, ain't nobody got time to be squeezing their own orange juice. It's something we never make for ourselves. It's a treat that you find at like a nice brunch spot or a resort, but this makes it super easy. You just slice your orange in half, put it in there, pull down the lever and it'll automatically start juicing it. And it's something that kids can use too. I actually first heard about this from somebody who loved it so much because because their kids can like get up on the counter and use the lever and be involved in making the orange juice. This model retails for $139, but Breville is a pretty popular brand. And I would imagine that somewhere that carries this is going to have a Black Friday sale. So you can probably get it for a deal. My next gift idea is these beautiful wintry mountainscape coasters. I found this shop on Amazon that has really cool coasters. They also have like a foresty version that I almost got. They retail for $13.99 for a set of four and they look so good. They look even better in person than they did online and they're a stone type material. I think this would be a good gift idea if you know somebody who is outdoorsy, who would be into the mountain vibe. They're also a good size for a stocking stuffer or something to take to a gift exchange because everybody uses coasters. My next gift idea is the Aesop Reverence Hand Wash. And I know what you're thinking, hand soap as a gift? This is no ordinary hand soap. And when I am done with my sales pitch, you are going to be buying some. I was recently walking through a mall with my husband. We were killing time before a dinner reservation and we could smell the Aesop store and we thought, sure, let's go in. And once we got in there, a woman asked us if we would like to wash our hands at their luxury hand washing station that they've set up. And in this era, you can't wash your hands enough. So we said, yes. I used this hand wash and it transformed me. It has exfoliating pumice in it. So it leaves your hands so smooth and the scent is incredible. I literally sat at dinner the whole time just smelling my hands, talking about how good they smelled. It retails for $38. Yes, I spent $38 on a bottle of hand soap. I am either that insane or this is that good. And I will let you decide on that one. I will link it down below. Get one for your person, get one for yourself. Honestly, you deserve this, trust me. My next gift idea is the coolest bath tray ever. Now you can find a lot of different types of bath trays, anywhere from like $30 to $500. $100. This one retails for $39.99. I found it on Amazon. And the reason it's so cool is not only is it an expandable bath tray, but it also has legs underneath it that fold out so it can be used as a regular tray. I love a good multi-purpose product. And this has a little flip up holder for your iPad, your Kindle, your book, whatever. It has two little removable trays where you could put snacks or your phone. There's also a dedicated phone holder slot here. There's a spot for a glass. There's also a spot for a wine glass to slip in. It also expands really wide. So I would imagine that this could fit on almost any size tub, like even a big oval shaped tub. The next item I wanna talk about is from today's sponsor, Lark. I've talked about Lark a few times over the years. I have their very popular Lark bottle that has the UV sanitizing light in the lid. They've recently released the Lark Pitcher Pure Viz with a similar concept. And not only does it purify your water, it also pairs with an app to allow you to track how much water you're drinking out of the pitcher. This has a two-step filtration and purification process. First, your water goes through a carbon-derived filter that removes lead, chlorine, etc., And then the PureViz UVC LED light eradicates biocontaminants like mold and bacteria. And the light activates automatically whenever you refill the pitcher, as well as every six hours to prevent bacterial growth. And it intelligently tracks how much water you're filtering so you know exactly when you need to change your filter. Which, if I'm being honest, I could have used a long time ago because 
I haven't always been really diligent about remembering to change filters. I filtered my water like this for a really long time. Ever since I moved to LA when I was 21, that's when I first learned that people filter their water. I thought it was so strange. I moved into a shared apartment and it was like the water was in a jug in the fridge. And I was like, huh? Because where I grew up, everyone just drank the tap water, but that's where I got in the habit of filtering my water. Anyway, this comes in two colors, white and navy. It retails for $118 with a filter subscription or 148 with no subscription, which definitely makes this a luxury version of this type of product. But it's also the type of product you use every day for years on end. So if you know somebody who appreciates a very practical gift that they will definitely use or you want one for yourself, I will have a link down below. So be sure to check it out. My next gift idea is the beautiful Vitruvi Stone Diffuser. I'm not super into essential oils and diffusers and all of that. I know that there's a community that's all about it, but I've never really gotten into it. However, I have become increasingly wary of candles over the years, particularly because because I learned that apparently a lot of them are toxic. So when you're burning them, you're burning chemicals into your air that aren't good for you. I also did have an incident in college where I lit my bathroom on fire. If you followed me for a really, really long time, you might remember that video on my vlog channel. It wasn't a big deal. I put it out. There wasn't a lot of damage, but I am so lucky that I caught it when I did. Otherwise it would have been a really big deal. And oddly enough, I still got my security deposit back for that apartment, which just goes to show how much damage they're used to finding in college apartments when you can light a wall on fire and they're just like, yeah, yeah, not a big deal. Anyway, I still like candles. I'm just hyper aware of them when they're lit, which is why I like the idea of a diffuser. And you can get so many cool diffusers these days. You can get ones that pair with apps. You can get ones that have cool lights. I was drawn to this one, frankly, because it's just gorgeous. It's ceramic. They make it in a ton of gorgeous colors and it looks like a piece of decor. Like it actually looks nice. It retails for $119. And if you're looking to gift some oils with it as well, they have a holiday kit right now that has for festive wintry scents in it that would be a perfect pairing with this. My next at home gift idea is this super, super soft palm detail blanket from Pottery Barn. I have tried a lot of different blankets from a lot of different places and Pottery Barn always wins for me. They make the best blankets. This one retails for $49.99. It comes in a bunch of different colors. They have a lot of really nice neutral shades. If you're looking to go a bit fancier, Pottery Barn also makes these amazing Amazing faux fur blankets. I think they started around $150 and go up from there, unless you get them on a sale. They do go on sale sometimes. I bought one like seven years ago. I think I showed it in a home haul when I bought it and it is still my number one most used blanket. It's on the couch in the other room. I sit with it every single night when I curl up on the couch. And now that I'm hearing myself say that and I realize it's been seven years, maybe it is time to <laughs> refresh it and buy a new one, but they're amazing and super soft, just like this one. So you can't go wrong with Pottery Barn blankets. My next gift idea is a home s'mores maker. I love s'mores, but I only have s'mores when I go camping and most of the year I'm not camping and that shouldn't stop me from having s'mores. I I saw this little kit and I thought it looked so fun, both for adults or kids. And what I liked about this one is it's electric, so you just plug it in where a lot of them require fuel canisters. It retails for between $25 and $40. The brand seems to make a few different versions of the exact same product and they're all priced differently. So I actually paid $40 for this on Amazon. And then I went and looked again and they have like literally the same thing listed for $25. So I don't know, look around, try to find the cheapest one. But I think this would be super cute gifted with marshmallows and graham crackers and chocolate. And it's one of those gifts that you can open on Christmas day. Like you can open it up, get a movie going, get some s'mores going and you can really just start enjoying it right away. My next gift idea is great for the plant lover or somebody who you aren't seeing in person this year and you're sending a gift to. It is a plant from The Sill. The Sill is a live plant delivery company that is a very curated selection of plants and plant products. Right now, they even have a Norfolk Island pine. If you're looking for something festive, you could like literally decorate this thing with lights and ornaments for the holidays. I discovered this company because when we moved into this house, we had some friends who sent us a plant from The Sill and I've loved it. The plants start around $30 and the really cool thing about the sill is you can just pick out a plant and buy it individually or they offer both three and six month subscriptions where you get a plant every month and you can specify what size you want, if it needs to be pet 
friendly, which I think is really fun, a subscription service for a new plant, especially if the person you know has just moved into a place and they don't have any plants and you know they like them, or if you just know a plant crazy person who can't get enough and would love to be surprised with a new one for three or six months. So those are my at home slash home essentials slash cool home stuff gift ideas for this season. I will have everything that I talked about in this video listed and linked down below. I would imagine that a lot of this stuff is going to have sales for Black Friday. So definitely if you're seeing this video before then, keep an eye out. If the stuff in this video isn't perfect for the person you're shopping for, I hope it's sparked an idea for something that would be great. And if you have any good ideas for gifts that fit into this category, let everyone know what they are down in the comment below. Happy holidays. I hope you're having a wonderful start to your holiday season. Season, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.